This week, a coalition of black businesses and community groups are coming together to help many families here make ends meet. It's called the Thanksgiving Hug and is partly funded by Denver native and billionaire Robert F. Smith. Connor McHugh met with those groups today, joins us live in Park Hill. And Connor, anyone in need of a hot meal can get one. Yeah, Karen, for another hour tonight and another four hours tomorrow, anyone in need around the Denver area can come here to the old Park Hill Golf Club and get a meal like this that'll have turkey and ham and all of the fixins on the side. Now, here in the Denver area, giveaways like this on Thanksgiving are nothing new or out of the ordinary, but the coalition behind this one is something new. At the old Park Hill Golf Course Wednesday, families from all over Denver came for a helping hand. You're welcome. Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> for some, these hot meals are a welcome relief amidst tough times. Others, like Latasha Britt, simply needed something after COVID changed the family plans. We have a full turkey and they said trimmings as well, so it's a, it's a great blessing. This meal giveaway is a first-time collaboration between several black businesses and community organizations, including the Struggle of Love, McBride Impact, and NAACP. We have turkey, we have ham. All meals come courtesy of Fathima Dickerson's famed Welton Street Cafe, despite currently being in between buildings. This has been difficult, but it's, it's a joy to be here, still in community, still serving. Officially called the Thanksgiving Hug, this effort is partly funded by Denver native and black billionaire Robert F. Smith. The idea is to help community as inflation affects many aspects of life. It's starting to impact our, our traditions. So communities came together and said if there's a way that uh, collectively we can have a larger impact, um, that's what we're working on right now. This year, the goal is to serve thousands in need from Northeast Denver and beyond, then hopefully in the future, do it all again. We just need to lean in on each other just a little bit more. You know, this can help build a better community, I'm all for it. Again, if you are in the Denver area and are in need of a meal like this, you can come here to the Park Hill Golf Course until about 6 o'clock tonight. Tomorrow they will be back here between 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Live in Denver tonight, Connor McHugh covering Colorado First. Just fantastic, Connor, thank you. And for those of you planning to cook at home,